Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. New Miss America exposed as a fraud. Dash outraged New Yorkers can't believe she was crowned. The woman found best to represent the country in all things beauty, poise, and purpose was decided on Sunday at the Miss America pageant. While the event had much of the same glitz, glamour, gowns, and tears as all the years before it, there was something very different about what's become another politicized stage event. Miss New York, 25-year-old Nia Franklin is crowned as Miss America 2019 and said after her huge win that she is part of history. After a nearly 100-year run, the Miss America pageant that Franklin won was the first to have eliminated the controversial swimsuit portion of the pageant. This decision was made after former Fox News anchor and 1989 Miss America winner, Gretchen Carlson, who is also the most outspoken advocate of the hashtag MeToo movement, was named the organization's new chairman, according to The Washington Post. While it's true that Franklin made history at this particular pageant, her co-workers are calling her foul that she should have never been crowned as Miss New York to begin with before going on to compete for the Miss America title. The shock and upset could seem like jealousy to some, but outraged fans are even going as far as to call her a fraud who doesn't deserve the title. The Daily Mail reports on the outrage and why angry fans claim the organization crowned the wrong woman. It's only been a few days since Nia Franklin traded her Miss New York crown for the coveted Miss America title, but there's already some outrage about her big win. After learning that the 25-year-old pageant winner is a native of North Carolina and only moved to the Big Apple last year, some New Yorkers are upset that she was allowed to represent the state in the beauty competition. If you are subletting you don't know the first thing about living in New York, Brooklyn hairstylist Jenna Pitico told the New York Post. If you have only been here for like five minutes, you don't know s. Twitter user Marsha Lorraine posted, Is Nia Franklin from New York or Winston cause I'm confused? A North Carolina radio host didn't seem phased that Franklin was representing the Big Apple. Dear New York, you're welcome. Nia Franklin technically belongs to North Carolina, so we'll just take credit for molding the new hashtag Miss America, Ramona Holloway tweeted. Franklin was born in Winston-Salem and remained in North Carolina through college. She relocated to Brooklyn after receiving the Keenan Fellowship for New York's Lincoln Center. She won the Miss New York 2018 title in January. During the Miss America competition on Sunday, Franklin was quick to show her support for the Big Apple, saying, I have New York grit. As a New Yorker, I understand what it means to work hard. The beauty queen reiterated those sentiments during an interview on Monday with The Post. While Franklin understands why some people may be upset she's not a native New Yorker, the classically trained opera singer said she's proud to represent the state. Even though I wasn't born in New York, I feel like I've always had grit. Moving to New York right after receiving my master's degree really solidified the grit that I have, she said. People always say the first year in New York is the hardest. I celebrated my first anniversary June 26 and I'm really proud of that. Franklin moved to Brooklyn in June 2017 and went on to win Miss Five Boroughs before becoming Miss New York. According to Miss America's residency rules, contestants must reside, work or attend school in a state for at least six months before they can represent it. Mallory Hagan, an Alabama native who won Miss America 2013 as Miss New York, said the lax residency rules are designed to help young women who want to expand their horizons and isn't necessarily about growing up in the state the competitor represents. The rules about residency and work requirements are meant specifically for young women who may go out of state for college or move for a job, she said. Judith Ann Graham, who was Miss New York in 1972, said Franklin rose to the occasion to represent New York in the competition. New York is edgier, and we have the best of pretty much everybody. But it's not every Miss New York that can step into those shoes. Nia happens to be one of them, she said. Franklin is not the first transplant to represent her new state and since it's actually within the rules to do so, it sounds like maybe natives proud of their state and roots just don't feel that she's earned the right to call herself a real New Yorker yet. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.